Hey everyone, welcome back to effect for you channel. Today, we are going to create modern girls vlog opener, like this. So let's get started. First create a new composition, 1920 by 1080, I call this main comp. Then create a new solid layer, and select any color as you like. Now here I have a half tone illustrator file, so drag this file into the after effects. Here you can see this type of pop-up appear in your screen. Select import kind, composition, and footage dimensions, document size. So this will create new halftone composition, open halftone comp. Here you can see a halftone design. Now we need to animate this, so select any one layer, hit T for opacity, hold alt key and click on the stopwatch icon and type wiggle expression. Right click on opacity and select copy expression only. Then select other layers, and paste the wiggle expression. So our half tone look like this. Cool. You can find more half tone from freepick.com. Before import the illustrator file into the after effects, make sure our each circle have individual layer. Perfect. Now drag half tone comp into the timer line. And move left corner side of the comp. And resize according to you. Now we need to create a rectangle shape right side of the comp, so select rectangle tool, and create a shape like this. Move anchor point center of the shape, and select any color as you like. Now open transform rectangle 1, and increase the skew little bit. Now we need to animate this so hit P for position. Go to around one second forward, and add a keyframe, then go to first frame, and move shape layer right side of the composition. Select both keyframes and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. Cool. We also need to create shape on left top side of the composition, so duplicate the shape layer. And delete both keyframes. And move the shape top left corner. Go to one second forward and add a keyframe. Then go to first frame and move the shape layer, left side of the comp. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. And move the layer few frame forward. Now we need to create one more shape top right corner, so duplicate the shape layer again. Delete the keyframes, and move top right corner, and change the color as you like. And move the layer bottom of the first shape layer. We also need to animate this, hit P for position, go to around one second forward, and add a keyframe, then go to first frame of the layer, and move the shape right side of the comp, select both layer and easy ease them, and make your graph like this, and also move the layer few frame forward. Cool. Now duplicate the half tone layer, and move above the shape layers, and also move right side of the composition, and resize it little bit.
We also animate the both half tone layer. So select the first layer, go to first frame. And add a keyframe on opacity and change the opacity 0%, then go to few frame forward, and change the opacity 60%. Also, do the same animation on second half tone layer. And move the layer few frame forward. Perfect, it's look good to me. Now we need to add our image here, so create a new composition, change the width according to you. and I called this image placeholder1. Then drag your image into the timeline, and resize according to the composition. Now go to main comp, and drag image placeholder into the timeline, and adjust right side of the composition. We need to animate the image, hit P for position, go to around 1 second forward, and add a keyframe, then go to first frame and move the image placeholder bottom side of the composition. Select first keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Now here I have a bounce script, so copy the script. Hold alt key and click on stopwatch icon. And paste the script here. So our animation look like this. Move the keyframe according to your choice. And also move the layer few frame forward. Perfect, it's look good to me. We also animate the scale of image placeholder. Go to first frame of the placeholder layer, and add a keyframe, then go to around 10 second forward, and increase the scale little bit. Cool. Now here we have some elements. And drag the heart image into the timeline. Resize according to you. Now we need to animate the heart image, so go to around 1 second forward, and add a keyframe on scale, then go to first frame and scale amount 0%, select both keyframe and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. We also add wiggle expression on position, hold alt key and click on stopwatch icon, and type wiggle expression. Also move the layer little bit. Cool. Now duplicate the heart layer, and move other side of the composition. Rotate it little bit. And also increase the scale little bit. Perfect. I have some more elements here, so drag the elements into the timeline, and adjust where you want, and resize little bit. We need the same animation, as we done with heart image. So select heart image, hit you to so keyframe, and copy the keyframes. Then select our lighting image, go to first frame and paste it here. Here you can see the keyframes. You can adjust the scale amount according to you. Cool, we also add the same wiggle expression on the position. And move the layer a little bit forward. Perfect. Similarly, add other elements also, 
I am skipping this part so that you do not have to wait. After add all elements our comp look like this. Cool. Now we need to add our text here, so select text tool and type your text. Now we need to animate the text, open text layer. Go to animate and select position, scale, and opacity. Unlink the scale. And change X scale 0% and opacity 0% and position X 100. Then open range selector 1. Go to first frame and add a keyframe on start. Then go to 1 second forward and change the amount 100%. Now we need to add expression on this text. So go to add and add expression. Open expression selector. Here I have delay script, copy the script. Hold alt key and click on the stopwatch icon. And paste it here. Now you can see our text. Cool. Now we need to add another animator, so select text tool, go to animate, and add scale. Change scale 110%. Go to add, and add wiggly. Open wiggly selector, minimum amount 0%. And wiggles per seconds 5. This is give wiggle effect on our characters. Cool. Now create one more animator, and select tracking. Go to first frame, and add a keyframe on tracking amount. Then go to 6 to 7 second forward. And add tracking amount 10. Perfect. Now duplicate the text layer. And I call the first one is pink layer. Then select second text layer, text color none. And stroke color black. Now open position of both layer. And move the position little bit. And parent the first text layer with second text layer. So we will easily move both layers together. Perfect. And also move the both layer few frame forward. Now we need to add our logo, so create a new logo comp. And adjust width and height according to you. Now you can add your logo and type your text. Select text layer, go to layer menu, go to layer style, and select stroke, change stroke color white, and adjust text according to you. Now go to main comp, and drag logo comp into the timeline. Now animate this, move the anchor point bottom center of the comp, hit S for scale, go to one second forward, and add a keyframe. Then go to first frame, and change the scale 0%. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. And move the layer few frame forward. Cool. Now we need to add background text in our composition, so type any random words. Text color none, and stroke color white. 
and decrease the opacity as you like. And move the layer above the shape layers. Now we need to animate this. So open text layer, go to animate, and select scale, and opacity. Unlink the scale, and X scale 0%, and opacity also 0%. Now open range selector, go to first frame, and add a keyframe on start, then go to two and half second forward, and change amount 100%. Cool. Again select the text layer, and add position, go to first frame and add a keyframe, and change X position 300, then go to around 10 second forward, and change the position, minus 300. So our text will move like this. Now again select the text layer, and add scale. And increase the scale 106%. Then select animator 3, go to add, and select wiggly. Open wiggly, and minimum amount 0%. And wiggles per second 5. This will give wiggle to our text. Perfect, it's look good to me. Select all layers, and precompose them. This is our scene 1 comp. Now create scene 2, so duplicate the scene 1. And move the layer around 3 second forward. Now go to project window and duplicate the scene 1 comp here. Hold ALT key and drag the scene 2 comp over the scene 1 layer, now open scene 2 comp, and also replace the image placeholder, so duplicate the placeholder in project window, hold ALT key, and replace image placeholder 2 with placeholder 1, open placeholder 2 and change your image. Cool. You can also change the direction of the shape layers, placeholder, and text layer. I am skipping this part so that you do not have to wait. After or just all the layers our comp look like this. Perfect. Our animation has done, hit zero for ender. Thanks for watching, I hope you like the video. If you like the video please share it, like it, and subscribe our channel. For more tutorial I'll see you in the next video.